First of all, congratulations. Thank you. Cheers, thank you. How are you feeling now you've had a little bit of time for the news to settle in? Well, I think we've kind of, we've been through the roller coaster, you know, mm. the nerves, the highs, you know, a little bit of a low feeling, um, you know, really feeling for, for Mia and John, who, you know, we really knew uh, that they would have been uh, a deserving couple. And, and now it's kind of, the, I guess the excitement is building. Yeah, yeah just, uh, you know, knowing that we've got a, a wedding in, in two weeks time. Uh, <laughs> obviously a lot to, uh, to plan and work out between now and then. Uh, so that's going to be a busy couple of weeks, but uh, it, you know I'm sure it's going to be a, a fantastic day. I know all our friends and, and family are really looking forward to it. Yeah. Uh, and then yeah, honeymoon to Australia, <laughs> uh, which is, is something to look forward to. What do you think about being the first couple to ever get married at somewhere so historic like Warwick Castle? Oh, really, really excited! It's such a beautiful place. You know, it just unbelievable yeah I mean we were we actually went there uh, last weekend on, on Sunday uh, and it had been two or three years since I'd, I'd been there so I, I had forgotten how great a place it was uh, it looks fantastic uh, yeah to be getting married in the uh, the, the state hall is uh, is a pretty you know grand thing isn't yeah it? just like the perfect venue <laughs> We've not got much time now to kind of get no. organized I know the guys here are, are doing a lot of that for you but mm. What, what sort of questions are in your mind? What kind of things are you thinking about now? Now you know it's just two weeks. Uh, <sighs> colours. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, colours, yeah. dress. Uh, yeah, everything, yeah. Just all those things that you'd have to sort out for a, a wedding, you know, the guests, mm -hmm. the music. Uh, just, yeah, I mean, we've got, we've got a huge amount to do, but it's just so exciting, really looking forward to, uh, to doing it. Yeah, oh. we've, we've got a really big, a big thank you list as well. We mm. just can't believe how ace and supportive everyone's been, all of our friends, all of our family. Everyone's really rallied around, really, really supported us this week and really made us proud. Yeah, ab absolutely, I, yeah, I agree with Laura. We've, we've got so many people to thank. Uh, it, it will take us uh, two or three days just to, to do that. <laughs> just to reply to the text. <laughs> the, bri uh, the best man's not got very long to kind of come up with his speech either, is it? There's no, a lot of the pressure best on man, think he's gonna have to be notified. Yeah. The bride's father. <laughs> We're, uh, we're going to have to rustle up uh, something something pretty quick. Yeah, you know any good speech writers? <laughs> we're uh, in the market. <laughs> yeah, but uh, yeah, I'm, I'm sure they'll uh, they'll come up with the uh, with the goods and uh, they'll, uh, they'll do us proud. Yeah, you came up with some pretty creative ideas when you were campaigning. Um, what what it was quite a kind of full on game to get you mm -hmm. to win this prize, and you mm -hmm. I mean you drummed up loads of support and votes, which ultimately got you it. How, what was that like? The process. It's been a, a 24-hour um, campaign, almost. It's, it's been hard. The, the, the challenges were uh, were tough mm. uh, because they were just they were so sort of open. You could do absolutely anything. Mm. So uh, yeah, it took us took us quite a bit of, of time to, to come up with those ideas. But certainly, you know, the, the star idea, you know, we, we were quite happy oh, with it in terms, of, in terms <laughs> of uh, you know, it just seemed like a, a nice thing to do. That these guys mm. here at heart have, have got their. Uh, you know, a star named after them, yeah. uh, and and in terms of, uh, of raising money for uh, Cancer Research UK, uh, as we said on the radio, we've we've both previously done mm. uh, activities to raise money for various uh, cancer charities before. So we just thought that, you know, hope that that was a uh, you know nice gesture, and, and obviously we'll continue to to do yeah, uh, fundraising activities going forward. How close is the prize to your dream? You know, like a castle, <laughs> no one, a princess. Yeah, well, you know, what girl doesn't grow up imagining that you know her big day will be in a castle you know she'll be the princess for the day so yeah it's just unreal it's amazing and and also the you know australia what a you know fantastic mm. country we uh you know we we're, we're honestly not saying this it, i think it would be the place that we'd both say is our, our favorite place in the world mm. so to have a two-week honeymoon there is, is awesome thank you very much enjoy thank, thank you, you. Thank you. <laughs>